Coronavirus UK, 250,000 NHS volunteers wanted as death toll hit 422. 21 coronavirus patients have died at a single London NHS trust as the UK recorded its highest daily number of deaths from the disease. The Department for Health and Social Care announced another 87 deaths across the country on the first day of a nationwide lockdown to counter COVID-19, taking the total to 422. London North University Healthcare NHS Trust recorded 21 deaths across its four hospitals, which includes one, Northwick Park Hospital in Harrow, that declared a critical incident last week after a surge in coronavirus patients saw it run out of intensive care beds. 83 of the 87 total deaths came in England, with two in Scotland, one in Wales, and one in Northern Ireland which is up from 55 deaths across the whole of the UK on Monday. The number of confirmed cases in the UK now stands at 8,077, which is up 1,427 from 6,650 on Monday, and 90,436 people have now been tested for the disease. In the first e-conference live broadcast from Downing Street, Health Secretary Matt Hancock has said the government is seeking 250,000 NHS volunteers to help during the COVID-19 pandemic. Mr Hancock has also said a temporary makeshift hospital will open in the Excel Centre in London. Saying, we will, next week, open a new hospital, a temporary hospital, the NHS Nightingale Hospital at the Excel Centre in London. The NHS Nightingale Hospital will comprise two wards, each of 2,000 people. With the help of the military and with NHS clinicians we will make sure that we have the capacity that we need so that everyone can get the support that they need.